Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello everyone. Hello, everyone. Meet Adina Phillips. She's new here. She'll be joining us to finish her senior high school here in St. Monica's College. I want you all to give her the support she'll be needing to meet up with the syllabus and also to navigate the hurdle of the environment. Um, Anissa, please show her around. I'll do that, Miss Angie. Anissa is always busy with studying. Important stuff, please. Don't worry, Lita. I'll show her around. That's enough, girls. Adina? Yes, ma'am. Go on, sit. Thank you, ma'am. All right, ladies. That'll be all for now. Thank, Thank you, Miss Angie. Okay. Yes. Why are you kneeling under the sun? By who? No student is allowed to punish another student. Get up and go to your class now. Thank you. I think you should mind your business around you. What I just did is minding my business. Please, where is the library? You know, I'm glad we decided to stay back at St. Monica with us. Well, I didn't have much option as it is. I was to choose going abroad or staying back here. You know how passionate I am about our dear country. <laughs> I'm glad you stayed back. At least we'll still be friends again. For the records, we are still friends even if we're in different schools. Mm, of course. Hey, Mr. Rosemary, girl. Over here, inside my nose. Ooh. What do you think of the new girl? I am way too busy to think about someone I don't even know. Whatever. Start to wait here. Where the hell did she go to? Hmm. I see they want me to shed blood in St. Monica. We shall see. So what exactly did she ask me to do? She asked me to kiss her toes and I refused. We have to report her. That is new year. Even if we do report her, Nothing will be done to her. So I am tired of reporting being bullied. Do you know I can, I can strangle you again? Do you know? Please. I asked you to kneel down. Why did you leave? Why? 
She asked me to leave. Who? So it's you. Get out of here. Now. Listen to me. You will stop bullying people. You hear me? Hey. What the fuck is this bitch? She's fearless like a tigress. She's bold like a lion. She's too neat cause she can't. I say. She didn't even flush. Wow. There's no way I can use this. Hey, go and flush the toilet. You're the last person that used it. Are you normal? I am normal. You're the one that is delusional. Why would you use a public toilet and not flush it? Where are you from? You're embarrassing me, girl. Go and do it now. Adina, please, mind your business. Cleanliness is my major business. So if I'm going to coexist with you folks, everyone must get it right. Go and do it. Adina! Go and do it. Did you notice anything? The new girl wants me to kill her at this school. And that I will do. She released Karina for my punishment. Who knows I should better warn her? I'm not as good as I look. I'm worse than I look. I'll just give her benefit of doubt. And she needs to apologize to me publicly. Else. <laughs> Are we still going out tonight? Ah. Uh, sure. It's almost 6 pm. We need to start getting ready. I really need to shoot. Oh. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Oh. It's a hot thing. For the second time today, mind your business around here. You don't want anything to happen to you, our friendship. For the second time too, I'll be fine. We didn't say this before. Now you've heard it. Please don't just ask. Who is there? Come in. Her name is Adina. Thank you. Adina, thank you so much for rescuing me today. It's fine. It's it. Thank you. Do you want to join us? Oh no, I already had dinner. But okay. I can take this. Okay. So tell me, what do you do to whoever that made you stand at this house? Um, I really do like you, but you know I can't come out. Yeah. Except you're gonna come up yourself to see me. You know, pretend like we're just friends. Mm hmm. Calling right, bitch. Stop calling. She's mine. We're in love. You know that's not necessary.
you be getting out of a sudden? Don't kill me. No, they won't kill anything. Not when I'm in this country. <laughs> By the way, where are they going to? Hmm. They are always going out. And the security allows them. Which kid? There is nothing the rest of security or sir want to do or say. If he insists, they will call their parents and accuse them. You will lose your job. Would wow. you not rather stay mute and watch? Really? This is bad. Like, very, very bad. So, who is she? Oh, she's my roommate. She's also going out. Wow. Like, this particular girl goes out every night. This is serious. And the school authority, they don't do anything about it. They allow girls to move out any, any time. Ah. See, this discussion is bigger than me. Can I go in now? Sure, you can. Go ahead. Okay, good night. Good night. Really? So this is what they do here? They allow girls to sneak out, go to parties, do whatever they want. It's in Malika's college. Why would I hide from you? Um, uh, I was talking to. <sighs> Never mind. Good night. <laughs> hey baby. Hey baby. Who were you talking to? <laughs> Nobody. Are you sure? Absolutely. <laughs> Come on. Come on, fuck you. Okay. Okay, that ass on you. Hello girls. Hello, Hello ma'am. Ma Good day and welcome to a new academic year. For the new students, of course, you all are new to SS2. My name is Dr. Harris and I usually take SS2 on phases. Let's start by knowing the history of phases. How do phases come about? You know with a rough idea. Go ahead. My name is Adna Felix. I see. You are new. Go ahead. Ancient history of phases suggests that the elements of what became physics were drawn primarily from the study of anatomy, optics, and mechanics, which were methodologically united through the study of geometry. These mathematical disciplines began in antiquity with the Babylonians and with Hellenistic writers such as Archimedes and Ptolemy. I like, what's your name again? Adina Phillips. Adina Phillips, welcome to St. Monica College. Thank you. So, who can tell us who first discovered physics? Go ahead. Okay, honey. I'll call you back soon next. Alright. Adina. Is it a norm that students can use their phones while the teachers are teaching? Look, I tried to fight it. But I was asked to mind my business. So I sincerely think you should mind your business. Oh, I see. Yes, I did. Thanks for your time. You're welcome. I really don't understand you. Right there in your hand is the book containing the rules and regulation of St. Monica's College. Yes. I already read it over and over again, even before enrolling here. So what is the problem? These rules don't work. How so? Students sneak out to parties. They use their phones while the teachers are teaching. It seems to me you people are scared of the students. Oh, all rich parents, right? I get it. Maybe if you try to reprimand them, they would report to their parents and they would either withdraw from the unnecessary donations or take their kids out of St. Monica's College. Enough. Leave my office. I will. But Ma, I expect you, as the proprietors of this school, to do the right thing. You can fix this. And trust me, in years to come, 
These girls will turn out good and it will be to your honor. I said leave. Get out. What nonsense. She's fearless like a tigress and she's frozen like a lion. She's too neat cause she can't. Hmm. This place is messed up. I'm not clearing it, my dear. But that's double work. That's my job. Yeah, your job is good. But you're rather making the girls in some money can look useless. They should be held accountable for their laxity. I won't enforce that. Ma. My name is Adina, not Ma. We, the workers in this school, we are strictly warned not to disrespect any student. Please. Please give me the cleaning tools. If Madam Angie sees you cleaning, I am gone. I will tell her up there to do it. <laughs> no woman, don't toilet nonsense in this school. Really? And yet she allows her students to sneak out to parties. They even use their phones while the teachers are teaching. I think you're talking too much, you know, it's here. It's not for certain things. Find out who she is and get back to us. Do you hear me? Who? Oh. Alright, can I go now? No. Stand. Don't go. Wait. She's right. But it's too late to start disturbing anyone. Amendment. Enforcing the laws. But still, she has a strong point. Me for almost an hour. Also, don't you have anything to do with your time? Don't you know what you want to do? Be afraid. But we are friends already, and that's why we are in the same space. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Okay. Let's go to your room. Sure. Hi guys. How you guys doing? So Vin is out of your way now. Do you get anything special to get her off your back? No way. Why would I do that? See, if she tries it, I will fight her this time. Is it because I've been keeping quiet? Nonsense. I will even expose her. Uh-uh. Smelly thing. That's in your girl. Very, very I'm coming. Let me get something in the kitchen. Hello, Papi. Don't worry, Papi. I know how you like it. <coughs> I will do just that. <coughs> All right, Papi. Bye. Good evening, seniors. What do you have for me? Please, listen to this. I will even expose her. Uh-uh. 
Lisa. Uh-uh. Smelly thing. Yeah, I'm in the classroom. Any issue? Good. Go ahead. So tell me more about yourself. Yes, you want us to be friends. Hello. Are you sleeping with us tonight? No, I'm not sleeping here. <coughs> What's that sound? Maybe one of our seniors. Really, in this hostel, around nonsense. <laughs> Not going. My throat is dry. Kiss mm -hmm. me. Of this, I won't want you again. I said you should stop it. to believe is nothing like she's possessed. Her eyes stone. You know what? Just take it as a prank because I can't do. Girls, drop that trash, wash your hand and go back to your classes. Except for Adina. Good morning, ma. You didn't have to do this. There are cleaners that are paid to tidy the environment. Ma, all the girls in St. Monica's College are gradually going astray. I spoke to them about keeping their cells and their environment clean. And what you just saw is the practical, part one. Henceforth, don't. I will, as long as I'm doing the right thing. Should I tell your dad? Shred seems to be your greatest weapon. You report to them to their parents. Do you also tell them that their kids sneak out to parties? They use their phones while the teachers are teaching. They even go Enough. as... Enough! Stop it! Why is she making us do stuff? It's okay if she wants to save the world, but can she leave us out of it? She thinks she can cop the minas that's eating deep. She can actually, if we all cooperate. Change is possible for those who are ready to change. <laughs> well, are you ready to stop sleeping with older men? Or will you stop going out at night? This is not about me. Well, change starts with you. I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. 
Oh, please don't talk to me like that. I'm not your class. Hello, everyone. Going forward, no one, I repeat myself, no one is allowed to bring in their mobile phones into the classroom. It means you are only allowed to use your mobile phones in the dormitory and no more going out for any kind of event. Thank you. Why are you making these changes? Who is again influencing you? <laughs> she sounds like trouble. Trouble, you say? You don't What have you not seen in St. Monica College? Obviously. It's crazy. Have the mic. Yeah. All right. Okay, thank yeah. you. Thank you. Well, yeah. this is for those who don't sit in your country. <laughs> nice one, ma. One thing I know is that our decision was influenced by Adina's quest for perfection. We all can't be like you, girl. Just live your life the way you want and allow others. Live and breathe. Adina. Yeah. Oh, no, wow. No one is allowed to bring in their mobile phones into the classroom. It means you're only allowed to use your mobile phones in the dormitory. Thank you. This is not fair. We go out because the dormitory is boring. Why? Why restrict us? Why? Why? There's nothing extraordinary about her except what we already know. Rich parents, she's extraordinarily smart, won the best, overall best academic award in her former school. And she's well traveled like the rest of us, so. I see. No wonder she has influenced Miss Angie. So it's not about you. She's actually a virgin. And what is that supposed to mean? In a root of a hater, the truth is that babe is a goat. The greatest of all time. I should... Alison! Calm down. Ali! Please wait. Hi, seniors! Hey, what are you celebrating? Good to I'm not just stop by. Thank I'm not very good at school days. I see how she is with anyone that loves me. And I know she's a dinner that loves me to the moon and back. Oh, I see. Lovers. Mm, senior, it's a good jealous. It's for three of us. Let's enjoy. Hey! So let's chance. Let me go find out. Yes. 
She's always protecting me. Come, baby. Let's take her to the sick bay. I think you're right. I, I think you're right. Yes, we can't be too sure. Yeah, they can know this is all the way there. They so. I'm going to Hello girls. Hello girls. Mm. We contacted Nina's parents. They have actually asked that our cops be. Aww. Yes. She gave up the ghost here. And the hospital reported that it was a case of BID. So it means she died here. Everyone should stay in their room. Nobody should come to the class today. Please. Miss Angie posted it at the parents' WhatsApp group. Wow. Okay, Mom. Mom, please, can we talk later? All right. Can you imagine? Everyone already heard about the news. Next thing, they'll say life goes on. That's the sad truth. You know, just died like that. And you expect me to be cool with it? <laughs> Sorry, sorry, stop crying. <laughs> Still can't believe you lies dead. So what's next? Who will it be? Who will it be? Is it me? Oh my baby. God forbid you won't die. I'm leaving this dormitory. I can't stay here anymore. Mom, they are killing us. Please come and take me home, please. Don't my hammer, she's just angry. Yes, one of our students mysteriously died yesterday night. Okay, Ma. Disappear from here. 
Hello, girls. Hello. I know you are still mourning, but life has to go on. Okay? Nina has been buried quietly, as requested by her family. They do not want any candlelight night or any event at all in her honor. So we have to oblige and respect their wish. What killed her? I think the cause of her death is still unknown to us. It would be nice for us to commit her corpse and autopsy. What you think right now, Adina, is it consequential at this point? But she has already been buried and her corpse cannot be assumed for an autopsy. Moving on! Your exams is around the corner. So you need to start preparing. Also, on Saturday, we will spice things up by organizing a movie night watch party. Is that okay? <laughs> Take care.
Hello, welcome to a new academic section. St. Monica College is glad to have you back. And this information is for the SS2 students especially. If you are interested in running for the head girl, kindly pick up a form from Mrs. Tiana. Break a leg. Thank you. <laughs> I thought SS2 had a head girl. What happened? Yeah, her parents um, transferred her to another school in England, so we have to run for that. Oh, okay. Mm. Alright, that's fine. I'll let you know when this is ready. Okay, that'll be fine. Thank you. Hello. Welcome to a new academic session. St. Monica College is glad to have you back. And this information is for the SS2 students, especially. If you are interested in running for the head girl, kindly pick up a phone from Mrs. Tiana. Break a leg. Ladies, you all know how enthusiastic I am when it comes to school politics and leadership. Please, can I go on a post? <laughs> Never. Hmm? My dreams are way bigger. You are looking at the future governor of the state. So running for the position of a head girl will help give a first and experience in leadership. So, I am going to contest. I am not afraid of you. I want to run too. <laughs> <laughs> Just talk. <laughs> there is absolutely no way I'm going to be controlled, ruled, or governed by a tyrant like you. Uh -huh. So, girl, don't bother. Come on, Ali. Let the girl exercise a civic responsibility. We are in a democratic dispensation. <laughs> well, may the best, or do I say the luckiest person win? <laughs> Leadership is way bigger than luck. Ah, you're right. Apolline, what do you think? Well, I will say, may the best person with the poise, and the best person with the creed, and the most passionate to lead win. <laughs> Please stop, Anissa. Stop what? You like rock play. Later you see your class. Catch me if you can. Else you step down for me. Never. Anissa, <laughs> see my boo. Anissa, <laughs> Politics at any level is a very dangerous game. Come ready next time, bloody Samaritan. Please, 
talking about? Yeah, I'm good. Just strategizing. Hey, you. You know you're going to be my campaign manager, right? I'm royalty. I can't be your area and girl. <laughs> then be my high pleading. That's the demeaning job to do for a royal blood like me. Look, girl. I'm totally in support of your ambition to be a nurse head girl. But count me out of your team of area and girls. I can't be reduced to that level. My best friend, Adina, is also running for same post. So my hands are tied. Does that mean I'll get your votes? Right now, as we are talking, you have my votes. And you have mine too. <laughs> I'm not gonna fuck you, bitch. <laughs> and then I'm not gonna vote for you. <laughs> just, uh. just look at that. <sighs> ah. Good day, Miss Tiana. Good day. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I'm here to pick the form for SS2 head girl election. So you are contesting? Of course. That's the only reason Monica's college can receive. <laughs> so you are the rescuer? Yes, I am. These girls have derailed and I'm here to save them. Okay, Miss Rescuer. <laughs> Here you go. Thank you, Ma. Best of luck. Thank you. <laughs> oh, God. This is kids. What can I do for you? I need to pick up the phone. What form? For the election. I'm contesting, I'm contesting for the head girl. A junkie like you? You want to be the head girl of SS2? Don't correct the shame, Miss Tiana. I want to teach these girls how to live life. You know now, enjoy themselves. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> Karata shame. <laughs> Is there a word like that? Is that even an English word? Karata shame. Well, here you go. Mm. 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 Stay where you can help me win this post to me now. I need to be the head girl. Please. Go and start by removing that thing on your nose. And then iron your ruffled uniform. You know now, eh? it's a Gen Z style. <laughs> <laughs> Gen Z wants to lead Gen Z. <laughs> Total disaster. <laughs> Unyara. Hmm. These children. They think they know everything. What's that supposed to mean? Can't you girls greet me? Sorry, we didn't see you there. So as I was saying, I think Sinia Adina will be the best head girl. Better than any other person. You don't ignore me when I'm talking to you. You know this is harassment, right? One more word for me and I'll beat you up right now. Say someone suffering from an internal disease. How did you know that? It's obvious. <laughs> Okay, Vinny, what's going on? Some people know that I'm sick. How do they know? How? Okay, 
Let's be specific here. Who exactly are you talking about? Some junior students in this same hostel. Especially Godiva and Mo. I see. Okay, we are going to confront them now. So when you are writing anything drama, you use present tense, present continuous tense, past tense, past participle. Do you understand? Yes, yes Sina Dina. Dina. That's wrong. You should have not. Sorry about that. Why are your room is Manu? Where exactly? Yes, who? Don't be cocky with me, girls. Where is Manu and Godiva? They are the lobby, I guess. Wait. Vinny, what's the matter? You are angry. We are angry! How, How dare, dare you? you? What the? Why did they run like that? I don't know. You know what? Just stay here. I'll be back. Hello ladies. Hi Esel. Hi Ali. Vini, are you good? I've been no sharp mouth for me. Who be me do you? And what is that supposed to mean? It means what it means. You're lucky we aren't here for you. Exactly. Godiva, what did you say to Vinny earlier? Nothing. Okay, fine. Maybe I said something. I made reference about her health. So, what exactly are you going to do to me? No! Who's gonna be the head? 
who's gonna be the top? Some are there contesting, the rest of them protesting. Who's gonna lead the way? Then we fall on a tower. This is politics, hope you know. For someone to lead others, you need a super duper quality. It's not just the regular. So the question everyone is asking who's gonna be the one? Who's gonna be the end Something everyone is waiting for. Who's gonna be? Go ahead, deliver a manifesto. What should we expect from you if you become the head girl of SS2? Um, yeah, no, 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 no. The Gen Z right now. Eh? I, will, I will make my class fun and exciting. <laughs> and I'll take you all on girls night out and party with Next. Mm. Now let her finish. We don't have time for frivolous speech. Mm. Adina, you're up next. Just look at the person you want to go for class. Please go ahead. Hello, Miss Angie. Hello, Miss Tiana. My name is Adina Phillips. They know your name, just peel the bullshit. Precious. If I hear your voice without a permit, you will see the other side of me. Adina, go ahead. Thanks. My name is Adina Phillips. I'm in class two senior high. I'm here to publicly declare my M if elected as the class head girl. First, I will sanitize and organize my class in a way that it will be the envy of other classes. I notice that most of my classmates are of different educational opinions or the other. With me as the head girl, I will introduce the reading culture and make them believe that wealth without education is a waste and that education is the mirror of every society and that, that that's enough fresh oh come i'm um, fresh let's hear from you i don't have much to say because adina here stole my ideas <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about last time i shared an idea of becoming the class head girl and subsequently to the overall head girl of saint monica college Hey, Adina. Hey. Guess what? What? You're pregnant. I don't have anything you can use. 
Well, I am not pregnant, at least not yet. But you will, hence you go out every day. <sighs> Look, what do you think about me becoming the new head girl next time? Okay, that's nice, but who would believe you? You are reckless, you know. I know. That is why I want to make a man by serving. Like, if I serve them, educate them, make everyone I read and... You want more ideas? Yes, ma. Okay? Well, from what I see here, these are just mere accusations. And it doesn't disqualify anybody from contesting. Unless, of course, you can prove it. But I don't have an evidence. This is a fallacy. We're so sorry. Please go ahead with your manifesto. Sorry, I don't have anything to say to you. I can imagine. <sighs> Alright, guys. I'll be all for now. I heard that I start delivering a manifesto. My own is of all the things to do in this school that should not make that of a righteous girl in a dinner show. She become the Lord leaders of SS2. Well, never say never. Hello everyone. Hello. So ladies, you'll be voting tomorrow. Delegates, get ready to cast your vote. Do not sell your vote. Vote your conscience. Okay? So guys, you all vote for me and we're going to go out for guests next time. We're all rich kids, Leave me alone. Shut up. Listen. If you think you are going to win by delivering a masterpiece standard manifesto, then you have something else coming. I won't be alive and watch a breathless animal like you. Call the shots around here. Never. Then you are going to die. Then before I die, I will kill you first. What baffles me the more is our courage to talk back at us. When the real guests of Sesmonical's college are talking, you this non-entity, shut the fuck up! Everything is not all about what. Whatever you dream will surely come to pass. Very soon, baby girl. What are you people talking about? If you know what's best for you, let Adina be. I saw you watching her and wishing you could have her. Don't even do it. She's a witch. What do we do? Adina can never be my classic girl. Never. Interesting. Very <sighs> risky. What do you prefer we do? I think you should just let the girl be. 
Serving the public is suffering and it has lots of responsibilities. Yeah? I know you might not see it from my own perspective, but just let her be a bit. Hello everyone. Hello. 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 So ladies, it's time to vote for the choice of your head girl. Um, search your conscience and be sure who you really want to vote for. And also know that whatever you prefer to be your head girl represents you. I hope you get that. Yes. Let's start. Okay, you can write your, the name of the candidate. The blank. Where's the rest of the students? Let me go get them. All right. Where is your best friend? I don't know. Maybe she last the girls to watch herself fail. Please come on. Sure. Thank you, ma'am. By the way. Who are you voting for? That's a secret. I see. Yeah. Oh God, these children. Huh? What will I even do to them or give to them for them to understand that this door is not meant to be locked by this time of the hour? I'm not with my key. Huh? Oh, thank God I'm with my key. Chill, okay, Dima. Dima. Oh, my baby. Ah! So you are here? I've been looking for you all over. What's happening to you? My God! Why didn't Adina show up? We want to make the announcement and she's still not here. We'll make whoever comes second the winner. I wonder why she's not around. She looks so interested. Her absence at a day like this just goes to say that this generation can really pretend. You can say that again, please. Sure. <sighs> My brave girl, see, one thing I want you to know, you have to hurry up now. The election is still on. It has started long ago. I'll try again next year. Oh, next year. No, 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 don't tell me that. Very brave girl. I know you have already made it. You have to go now before anybody become victorious in anything in life you have to put garments of braveness are you hearing what i'm saying now you have to fight this war to the end to the last minute now you have to go out there let me finish what i'm saying i know you are weak you have to go out there and do what show your face let them not see that is because of they have you know 
they have shown their power on you they have tackled you they have threatened you that you are now running away no you are a brave girl you are hey my dear please no I know she will make it. She's a very brave girl. Huh? What dinner, my dear? My God will see you through. Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello. 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 Sanji. So, the winner for the head girl for SS2 is Prush. But our dinner won. Since she's not here, and it's now policy that you can only win while present. So, fresh is the new... She's fearless like a tigress And she's bold like a lion She's doing it cause she can I say she's fearless like a tigress And she's bold like a lion She's doing it cause she can She's so bold like a She's doing it cause she can She's doing it cause she can She's so bold like a lion She's doing it cause she can She's doing it cause she can She's then by truth and justice Against all evil practice She's one of a kind Everybody keep on asking Oh, is this girl? She's so bold like a lion man She's doing it cause she can She's doing it cause she can She's so bold like a lion man She's doing it cause she can She's doing it cause she can She's fearless like a tigress And she's bold like a lion She's doing it cause she can I say she's fearless like a tigress And she's bold like a lion She's doing it cause she can She's so bold like a lion man She's doing it cause she can She's doing it cause she can She's so bold like a lion man She's doing it cause she can She's doing it cause she can As the executive board of our confraternity, it's our duty to bring in any shining star you said to make us college. And obviously, Adina is a bright shining star in Sibonika. And we need her light. No, no. It's your duty to bring her in. But, but how do I do that? She's my senior. If you don't bring her, you'll go down. Like, you'll go down.
Hello, dear head girl. I am your senior. Don't let pressure and others deceive you. You will get into trouble. Adina, we run an all-female club in St. Monica College and every reasonable girl with a bright future must be a member. The benefits are uncountable. So as the head girl, it is our duty to entice those that are in authority. I know where this is going to, but don't waste your time any further. I am not interested. No, you don't get it, do you? We are not inviting you to join. We are announcing that you have joined us and you need to make yourself available for the next initiation process to commence. She's scared of us already. Moves! She needs to. So you came to St. Monica to mess things up for everyone, right? Lena, please leave this matter to rest. I only made an observation that needed to be corrected. And I'm glad Miss Angie was proactive. Hmm. Really? Yes, really. Lina, please wake up. Lina. 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 Please wake up. Lina. Lina. Lina, please wake up. Lina. Apparently, Lina is at the kitchen floor, unconscious, and I saw Adna trying to revive her. You know what? Let's go there, scare Adina, and kill Lina. That way, people will think that Adina killed Lina, and then she would be rusticated.
Adina. Yes. Are you all right? Yes. You just screamed. No. I'm okay. I'm fine. You're not. Okay. Who's gonna be the head? Who's gonna be the top? Some are they contesting, the rest of them protesting. Who's gonna lead the way? Then we fall on a tower. This is politics, hope you know. For some. It's not just the regular So the question everyone is asking Who's gonna be the one? Who's gonna be the head girl? Something everyone is waiting for Who's gonna be the head girl? Someone spectacular Also me someone very popular It must be smart in particular